we're back, everybody. Here's part two of the condo tour. Let me uh, turn on some lights here. So, first thing here, you saw the, the two skeletons on the last video. Here's another custom switch plate Nicole made. Moving up is the Roger Klein poster that we stole from a gig. And then, through guile and luck and audacity, we got them all to sign it, which Nicole loves, which I was happy to uh, make that happen for. Pulling back, pulling back, pulling back. These bookcases here are predominantly Nicole's books. I think they're entirely Nicole's books. I mean, she's got more books. Trust me, you'll see. Up top, some more coolness. That's my fourth wild turkey dispenser. That's the one I was talking about in the last video. X-Wing. A uh, swizzle stick collection. That's all Nicole's stuff there. A Jaws boat that one of the cats broke by accident and I was unable to fix. And to buy one new, jeez, cost prohibitive. Moving down here, a lot of true crime stuff, a lot of horror stuff, more tchotchkes. We've got tchotchkes for days. It's crazy. And a lot of it's my fault. I, I love to bring stuff like this home. It's the Cat Scratcher, because um, there are a couple of DJs. That's a little box. I attached a rope to it, and we pull them around the house, and they, they seem to enjoy it. Oh, Herschel fell down. Oh, crap. Let's see, more horror stuff, more cat stuff, a lot of owls, a lot of cats, a lot of gargoyles. Uh, we share a similar aesthetic, which is very nice. Now, let me show you this. <laughs> this is my comic book rack. Vintage spinner rack that I got from the store I used to shop at when I was a kid. It was a little corner store, and uh, I went in one day, and I... Asked him if he still had the racks, and he said, I got one in the back, and it was filthy, and I bought it off him for, like, I think, like, 40 bucks, which these things go for hundreds of dollars these days. So I've stocked it with the Marvel, mostly the Marvel True Believers books, because they're, like, reprints for a dollar, Marvel Tales, things like that, because they sit in the sun sometimes, and, you know, they're going to fade, so I figure, uh, if they fade, who cares? The reprints don't matter. So here is... The window. There's Bluebot again. Nice camera whore today. Let's see. Sunnydale banner there. Um, this back door was a, a clingy cling wrap thing that I did for Nicole when she first moved in. Before I lived here, I believe. And uh, she just didn't like the plain glass. So we bought this. And I think it looks cool. It was a real pain in the ass to do. But it looks good. Over here, another custom switch plate she did. Uh, over here, this piece, I don't even know. This might be worth something, actually. Um, it was in my grandmother's house, and when my grandfather passed, we brought it to our house because my grandmother's living with us. And um, when she passed, I never really even thought to ask what it is. But it's really cool, and we dig it quite a lot. This is Treasure, a creepy porcelain cat. Nicole got it at a punk rock garage sale thing. She loves treasure. I am ambivalent about treasure. Ramones poster, signed by the Ramones. That's Nicole's, obviously. A picture of Peaches, the Wonder Cat, up there. Uh, let's see. I believe Nicole made these drapes, if I'm not mistaken. Here's the couch. Blue Bod, you're in every shot, man. Um, the sheet is just because with these fuzzy little bastards, it's easier to throw the sheet in the wash to get the cat hair off it than it is to actually clean that damn couch. That's Diego. Uh, over here is a short shelf, and this is more Nicole stuff. And the books are hers. A lot of the Chaskis are some of the stuff I got her over the years. We swing wide. Okay, this lamp. My mom got this lamp in the 90s for her bedroom. And when we sold the house and we were moving stuff out, Nicole just said, I, I need that lamp. Can I have that lamp? And my mom said, sure, you can have that lamp. So it's very, it's a goofy lamp, but... It is kind of nice. All right, let's see. TV. Han Solo. Uh, Freddy Krueger glove. Vintage Fisherman. And these cars here, actually, these were my father's when he was a child. He gave them to me way, way back. They're super old because so is he. Uh, moving up, moving up. TV. This big old, you know, I have no idea. Was this... this a, I can't remember who painted this. It's not a Da Vinci, is it? I don't know. Anyway, it's not, you know, it's a print. Let's see. Moving along. Me and Nicole and the two cats when they were quite younger. 
Here is, this is the creepy fisherman. I don't like the way that guy looks, but we keep him. Up here, my big old Adat -at with my Luke Skywalker. Another Lucy doll. There was one in the short bookcase over there, but we couldn't fit them both up here. A picture from my mother's wedding. That's a lovely picture. Up here is a cool piece of lighting effect that the Kemps gave us, which I love it. I think it's great. There's a little lantern there. This, I think Nicole ordered from somewhere. Hokey religions and ancient weapons are no match for a good blaster at your side, kid. But it says good blast, not good blaster. So it's incorrect, but we still dig it. Moving along this way. Uh, my cousin Lori gave me that Star Wars piece up top for playing guitar at her wedding. There is a picture of Nicole's cat, Tim, from back before I met her. Uh, apparently, Tim was quite the character. Never had the pleasure of meeting him. Vintage Owl style thing. Another skull. More books. This is a picture of Peaches that I mailed to... God, what book was it? Was it Chew? I can't remember. But yeah, they posted a picture of Nicole's cat, which I thought was cool. There is a custom lightsaber. I'm not going to endeavor to grab it right now. Here is a Batman pillow, because yes, here is a loop art thing that Nicole got me a while ago that I finally put together. Day of the Dead skull mask. Halloween poster. This thing, let me go over here. This thing is large. And uh, she got it from a friend who unfortunately has since passed, and that's why the little funeral cards in the corner. Jim was a great dude, friend of mine as well. I got her the little Michael Myers to go up top. Over here. Big old retro mask style Astro Zombie, which I thought was cool. So, you know, we have that. Moving down, my lava lamp that I've had since, I don't know, like fifth grade. My little reading lamp. This is where I chill by the Devil's Rejects blankets when I want to read. Turn on the lamp. Yeah, as you can see, there's a stack of comics there. That I've not gotten to yet. Moving along. A stone gargoyle that I stole a long time ago from somebody who absolutely deserved it to be stolen. More books, more skulls, more Star Wars stuff. Another picture of Peaches, another cat. Yeah, it's mostly horror stuff, comic book stuff, and cats around here. Which leads me to the table here. Nicole's currently in the middle of reading this Joe Kenda book. We've got 15 remotes, because doesn't everybody these days. And then a friend of mine gave me this movie that we haven't watched yet. A couple more books. A lot of books. We're big readers when we have the time. So, real quick to wrap it up, because this is going on like eight minutes. Back over here, a uh, couple cool owls. Cool plate. Felix the cat. Do you know Felix the cat? Uh, he no longer works, but he's still cool. Then we go up here to this little thing above the bedroom, and then perhaps we should move into the bedroom in the next video.